LSU has stopped giving the Johnson & Johnson vaccine today after the CDC and FDA recommended pausing the use of the vaccine because out of the 6.8 million doses, there have been six rare cases of life-threatening blood clots. With LSU offering the COVID-19 vaccine to students, some are hesitant towards getting vaccinated for a variety of reasons, and the new report does not do much to ease anxieties. Reporter Georgia Peck asked students about their concerns and shared them with State Health Officer Dr. Joe Cantor. With the emergence of the COVID-19 vaccine has come many questions and concerns from college students. So I'm outside the student union today to get some opinions on the subject. What are some concerns y'all have about the COVID-19 vaccine? Um, I feel that like, like comparing it to like the flu vaccine, like they did like over 20 years of research on that. I feel like it's kind of under-researched. Uh, I really don't have any concerns about it, but I do think that people who are not vulnerable to the disease should not get it. If they like, mm -hmm. if, if that makes sense. Okay, why do you think that? Well, because there's a lot more older people who are dying that are unable to get it. I feel like, and they should be the ones that need it the most. You know? We talked about that in our genetics class because people were scared to get it because we're learning about COVID right now and how oh, wow. it affected people in Louisiana, Texas, Florida. So people in your class were concerned about it. Yes. What were their concerns? Do you know? They were scared of, inf it was actually like, literally they sent an email after because somebody had asked like, if I get it, will I be infertile? And so our professor sent like a big long email after class explaining why not. With these concerns in mind, I spoke with State Health Officer Dr. Joe Cantor, who is actively working to debunk the myths surrounding the safety and efficacy of the vaccine. Sometimes these myths get out there and they just perpetuate, you know, on a larger sense though, I, I, I get it. COVID has been confusing. Mm -hmm. It's been politicized. I mean, the entire duration of COVID has been politicized. Um, and so it makes people worry and, and, and question. And I think that's understandable. And, and I think it's good and, and natural to have questions. I just want to make sure people get connected with the right information. Dr. Cantor encourages everyone to get the vaccine in order to lessen the spread and prepare for emerging variant strains. Don't wait to get the vaccine. Don't wait because this variant is growing and we very likely could have another surge. Take the time to protect yourself now. You're not only protecting you, you're protecting your family as well. For Tiger TV News, I'm Georgia Peck. To see the full interview with Dr. Cantor and to find more information on upcoming vaccine days, check out our website, tigertv.tv.